Like the majesty of the mountains they live in, the stoneborn dwarfs have a long and rich history. They have thrived for ages in their enormous strongholds and towns built around caves, establishing a culture that embodies everything that it is to be a dwarf. Stories of their extraordinary abilities have gone far and wide throughout the realms, and their amazing feats of mining, crafting, and engineering have become the stuff of legend. An unshakable dedication to family, kin, and community is fundamental to their culture. These courageous and honorable individuals are renowned for their remarkable mental and physical ability, as well as their incredible proficiency as miners, artisans, and craftspeople. The dwarfs can create delicate works of art that appear to defy the very nature of the materials they employ, thanks to their calloused and rough hands from years of working with metal and stone. They are known for their ability to excavate precious metals, gems, and diamonds from the center of the mountains by going deep into the ground. They chisel away at the rock for hours on end, working nonstop until they find the jewels inside. The sound of their picks and hammers echoes throughout the vast underground mines, a relentless search for the treasures of the earth. Their mountain cities are filled with numerous instances of their extraordinary craftsmanship, ranging from magnificent halls and towering statues carved out of the stone itself to exquisite jewelry and sophisticated metalwork. The dwarfs' faces are warmly glowing from the flickering light of the forges as they labor, their eyes full of focus and pride in their achievements. Perhaps the most amazing thing about them is their strong sense of solidarity and dedication, who will stop at nothing to defend and help those who consider themselves to be part of their tribe because they firmly believe in the strength of togetherness and unity. Their civilization is characterized by a spirit of bravery and compassion that permeates every aspect of it, from how people work and trade to how they come together during difficult times. Because of their common adversity and unshakable loyalty, the relationships that unite the stone-born dwarfs are just as strong as the stone they create. They have faced many difficulties and challenges throughout history, from wars and invasions to natural disasters and other calamities. They always come out more united and powerful than before, no matter what challenges they encounter. The dwarfs are well known and highly esteemed, yet recently there have been reports that they have disappeared from the face of the earth. Many individuals are eager to uncover the fate of this once great civilization, following their sudden disappearance and mysterious whereabouts. Some people assume that the dwarfs made the decision to withdraw farther into their mountain strongholds, finding comfort in the very center of the planet they cherish so much. According to old legends, the dwarfs will eventually have to retreat even more into their underground territories, isolating themselves from the outside world entirely. Given their abrupt absence, these mysterious prophecies, long written off as mere legends, now have a terrifying new meaning. The stone-born dwarfs may still be thriving in the furthest depths of their enormous subterranean cities, their extraordinary mining and crafting abilities reaching new heights as they produce wonders the surface world can only dream of. One enduring tale that has captured the imagination of people across the realms is the story of a young princess who is said to have taken refuge with a group of seven dwarfs. Although the fairy tale describes a tiny home tucked away in the woods, considering the dwarfs' tendency to live inside mountains, it is more plausible that the princess ended up in one of the large dwarf cities. Still, the story's fundamental themes are consistent with the dwarfs' basic beliefs. They consider taking in a stranger in need, providing them with shelter and security, and staying by them through thick and thin to be more than a fairy tale. It is their way of life. This implies that there might be more truth to the fairy tale than first thought. The dwarfs' deeds in the tale are entirely consistent with their ideals of kindness and safety, supporting the notion that they really provided the princess with shelter and protection. Even though the stoneborn dwarfs are no longer visible to the outside world, their legend endures in the minds and hearts of everyone who has been impacted by their incredible tale. Those who possess the courage and determination to pursue them may still find their magnificent communities thriving amidst the depths of the mountains. The consequences of their disappearance are still a mystery, but one thing is clear. The world is significantly diminished without the Stoneborn's presence. Are they just biding their time, waiting for the ideal opportunity to end their self-imposed banishment? Or might their absence portend something much darker, an impending catastrophe that could swallow the entire world? Time will tell, but one thing is certain. Their legacy will live on, 
inspiring future generations with their tales of bravery, morality, and kindness. If you found this journey through the Stoneborn Dwarfs intriguing, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel. Your support fuels our expansion and inspires the sharing of more enthralling tales from the realm of fantasy and beyond. Thank you for watching.